I think that during this whole crisis, I've only seen my mother face fear once that I can remember. I know there must have been many times, but the time that it impacted me the most. We were coming home from a freedom rally, and we had old raggedy cars, you know, because all the kids rode in our car, you could look at and see the ground a lot of times, but we rode anyway, a whole car full of people all the time. And we were coming home from this rally, and we noticed that a group of white guys, men, were behind us in an old pickup truck. And I thought that they were just going to pass us or whatever, but they didn't. And the closer that we would get to home, our destination, the closer they would follow us. So the spokesperson for the NACP Youth Council is a young lady who's now a professor at a university down in Georgia by the name of Barbara Posey, and her father was a big man. And when I say big, he was a big man. And Mom said, told us, told Calvin and I, that these people are following us. And this is what I want you to do. When I turn this corner on Northeast 14th, I'll be blowing my horn, and I want you to run up to the poses and knock on that door as hard as you can. I don't know what these guys want, but whatever they want, it's not right. Now, do you understand me? Don't don't say anything, but do exactly what I tell you to do. Open that door, I'm gonna drive up there as close to the steps as I can get, and run and knock that door down. And that's what we did. But when we did that, and they let us in that house, my mother drove away. I think that that's one of the greatest fears that I've ever had because my thought was, will I see my mama again? Is it worth it that my mother would not come back to us? 